It's been a crazy week. Yeah. Six states, seven days. Hey, we're the Nikorchuks. We recently sold our home, bought an RV, and set out for life on the road. The plan? To enjoy our beautiful country and visit as many national parks, roller coaster parks, and ballparks along the way. Follow us on our adventure by subscribing to our YouTube channel. Mount Rushmore. We were so excited to go because the last time that we went, we were brand new married, so 17 years ago, moving across the country to Washington, D.C., and all we did was drive by. We stopped, took a very fast photo, and then kept going because this one... has been mad ever since. Yeah, wouldn't pay the $5 or $10 or whatever it was to park. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I We've Got about six more hours of driving to Sioux Falls All the way across South Dakota but had to make a quick stop at Wall Drug. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high. So as we were parking at this boondocking site last night, we noticed that one of our tires is flat. It's the outside dual. And I actually checked on the inside wall, there's a huge blowout. So we're gonna have to go into town and get that fixed. Park in Sioux Falls. Jumping from cliffs so high, trusting our wings to fly. Next up, Blue Earth, Minnesota. So, this is the very center, as far as east and west goes, of the country. And it's the home of the Jolly Green Giant. <laughs> and we've stayed in state parks, national parks, um, lots of different places. But one of the cool things that we've done a few times is Boondockers Welcome. It's an internet site where basically you can find a host home, somebody that's willing to let you stay at their place. And that's what we did in Blue Earth. This particular host home was amazing. From the time that we parked until midnight, we were hanging out. They invited us in for ice cream. So our Boondocking host tonight got us this cool little mobile that we get to drive out on his farm. Have a good time. Zeke's driving now. Woo! We're at the Grotto of the Redemption, which is something built by the Catholic Church, and it's got lots of precious stones and uh, yeah, jewels and rock uh, to depict nine different scenes from the life of Christ. So and this takes place in West Bend, Iowa. Heaven? No, it's Iowa. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Oh, we know what we have. Let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life. Wizard quest doing a wizardy adventure. Come on. We're gonna happen to be crawling around in places and stuff. We're eating macaroni and cheese. 
amazing to Wisconsin where some of these pieces made. What do you got? I got a bacon and ranch and chicken macaroni and cheese. Oh yeah, That's Wisconsin's finest right delicious. there. Delicious. Next stop was Chicago and it was a lot. We walked a ton. A lot of walking, 10 miles yeah. that day. And I would have to say the boys did excellent. Zeke is not a huge walker, but he, I, they love the city, we think. Yeah, they like the city, and city so boys. They're totally city boys. And so they hung in there with us. It was 10 miles in total. We took Harry along for the ride, which was a lot. Probably a bad choice. Poor decision. Should have just left them behind. <laughs> yeah. the day at Wrigley Field which was just kind of fantastic and definitely yeah, America's big. pastime good way to just to kind of kick back and chill after a long day so after a long day in Chicago and after the baseball game we made it back to the RV went right to bed woke up really early so we could drive five hours to St. Louis to catch a Cardinals game at noon it's a long day crazy bang bang we got two baseball games less than 24 hours but it was a lot of fun Right after the baseball game, we caught an Uber over to Anheuser-Busch and got a tour of the Budweiser Brewery. All right, it's haircut day for me, camping. I just wanted a no-nonsense kind of thing. So uh, Rachel was inspired and she saw this nice little state campground that we're in, St. Louis area, and she's like, it's haircut day. So we're over here in the shade, doing some haircuts. While we were in St. Louis, we decided to hit up Six Flags, which of course the boys love. That's their favorite thing to do. So any Six Flags we can go to, we're hitting them up. Right. Yeah, sometimes my wife kind of amazes me. See that thing that's just spinning? Yeah, she's in that one all by herself. Forget it. All right, last one. We're headed off to church, and then we'll get back and watch the Seahawks game. Next stop was Blue Earth, Montana. Just kidding, Minnesota. <laughs> Next, er, uh, Next stop, Blue Earth. I wanna say Montana every time. Ah, crap, I'm gonna get run over. Okay. We'll go with that. <laughs> okay. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and wanna to continue to follow us on our adventure, then subscribe to our channel and click the notifications bell so that you can be notified every time we upload a new video along the way. Also, one of the ways that we're supporting ourselves is by selling our CBD oil, which we grew on our farm back in Oregon. So if you'd like to purchase a bottle of our CBD oil, you can go to greenmethodfarms.com and purchase it there. Thanks so much for watching this video and make today extraordinary.